So first you have a mirror, an explorer to examine for teeth decay and the mirrors for indirect vision. Next you have your topical anesthetic and your cotton applicator which you just apply the topical with. Next you have your aspirating syringe, capsule and needle which helps with just the injection and just placing the anesthetic. Next, you have your straight. You have your straight evaluator to loosen teeth or separate and lift tooth from the socket. Next, you have your you have your periosteal evaluator to cut periosteal ligaments and teeth when the implant is in deep. You have your you have your universal mandibular forceps to extract the mandibular. And then your universal maxillary forceps. So I think I picked them up a little backwards, but that it helps to remove the maxillary and mandibular teeth. Next, you have your next you have your luxating evaluator to cut the periodontal ligaments before extraction. Then you have your high suction HVT HVE. <laughs> you have your cotton forceps for indirect retrieval. And you have your scissors just to cut anything like tissue or anything that needs to be cut during the procedure. Then you have your suture scissors which helps cut the sutures that you place. You have your hemostat and your longer hemostat which helps remove or place sutures. One of those is for place sutures. You want to just put, put down. Then you have your, next you have your root evaluator to loosen the root and to like separate it from the socket. And then you have your root tip evaluator to lift and remove fragments from the root. It's just like the single edge. You have your suture packet and 2x2 two two gauze. Yeah, that is a simple tray extraction. Bam, baby.